more open and more appreciative of all these other play styles that I see. I'm like, there's something different. It's cool. But moving on, we're going to start this uh, match. Good attitude to have. That's a great attitude to have, actually. Three, two, one. Hope you like being countered. <laughs> Ooh, time to see. <laughs> Hope you like being countered. <laughs> I need to put that one on, on when, I, when I enter a room. <laughs> Oh, okay, so the game plan for both characters is set to see how they interact with each other. Yoshi's is more of I'm gonna hit buttons and get these setups. Sonic is more of I'm gonna hit you and then jump to the other side of the stage. You <laughs> said so, like from frame one, Cog is like, alright, I'm not gonna give you any space to breathe because uh, she has really good buttons. That lets him go in. Yeah. And Sonic's like, okay, I'm gonna just oh, like try to take my That was almost it. That was almost it. That was forward airs are coming out. <laughs> 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 Look at the, the wall is being built like right in front of our eyes. <laughs> Dang. You hear she's building that wall. Yeah. That was a good escape by the Yoshi right there. Like knew that the Sonic was coming in with the spin dash and he's like ran all the way off the stage where he was like able to go underneath the platform and like avoid whatever Sonic was doing. Sonic had no choice but to like go away or wait. I think that's the one thing that I really like to cut to see Cog do. Like just from like the first minute of this match is that he's always pressing buttons, even when he probably shouldn't be. Like if uh, if Sonic starts using homing attack, that's the moment you gotta stop doing whatever the hell you're doing and just like really see what he's about to try to do. It might yeah. be unreactable, unreactable uh, online for the most part, like the timing, but you can still get like a really good punch if it doesn't hit you. Yeah, you know, like they say, like oh, how the shield break was almost happening. Uh, like they say, uh, online is a different game, so. What could be applied offline could be different in applying it online. It is true that the uh, Yoshi could uh, not hit so many buttons to get himself hit by Sonic's uh, helmet attack at the same time. Um, Cause in the Sonic, forward game, he's just Sonic, gonna press forward. Yeah, the Sonic could um, uh, make the input mistake, like it always happens with the was it like 12, 12 frames of lag on this plus. <laughs> Like it could happen. First thought goes to Yoshi. Ooh, four there. Nice. Good, well, good uh, combination. Yeah, Zach did a great job not like taking any damage. And like it's oh, it's already even again. Ooh, yeah. And that was like, right there, like the, the Yoshi was in buttons and he got hit by all the Sonic like, moves right there. Yeah. So I see. He has a lot more to do with Cog, like not really paying attention to what Zach's doing, and he's just trying to go in and try to keep pressure. Which I mean, that usually can be really like that can be really helpful. In this, in most matchups, but against Sonic in particular, because Sonic has multiple moves that mean that that make it so that it's really he's a really hard character to kind of catch okay, on so. a catch like that. It can be mm -hmm. tough. Yeah. So, shit. I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> like damn, like, I had it too. So it was like something about the matchup that I was noticing, but like, yeah. Um, Button presses are definitely getting uh, Cog hurt, but at the same time, I'd see I see Cog's mentality towards it. Like, like if it ain't, if it ain't broke, I'ma still do it. <laughs> like if it, that's definitely true. Yeah, like well, however that phrase goes, like, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> like if he's not getting killed for like doing that down beat or that, like he had him in that right situation for us. It's like I'm just gonna keep doing this, and you're not gonna ex expect this down beat to come out. Like you're, you're gonna jump away as you as you instinctively do just to try to avoid my character. I had perfectly clipped him right there for that stock. Ooh. This was the first. Oop, never mind. I was gonna say this was the first time that Cog actually uh, was able to exert some pressure on Zack and kind of keep him on the back row. Yeah. Well, he lost that stock pretty quickly the moment that he was able to. He that Zack was able to catch a breath. Yeah, the tug of war game here on the percentages is more looking like in Cog's favor because of how aggressive uh, Cog is playing and how uh, Zack is uh, sort of not handling it mm -hmm. as well. Oh, wait, that's real close. <laughs> so Sonic's um, spin dashes have two different properties depending on whether you're using forward or the downloads one. Mm. Um, in terms of like what kind of priority they have against projectiles and like physical attacks and also like how much of to they have on startup. Mm. Uh, so keeping that in mind is really important, uh, but for the most part, like if you see Sonic in Dash, jumping over him is typically the right thing to do. You don't want to try to challenge him right on the startup because he's always going to win. Because that's the principle you bring to all of us. Yeah. 
good on Zach right here to like use the spin dashes to try to get a homing attack out of chances right here because he's using them to get in at the same time as they whiff. If Yoshi does an action, he would just do the homing attack and get the damage in. Mm -hmm. Right now, this is doing good for the percentage game, but he's got to think about how he's going to take the stock right here in order to end this uh, first game. Well, Kara, on the, other, on the other hand, could uh, run a good setup and just take the stock too. <laughs> The charge is right in his face. Oh. Solid back air to keep him off. Oh, drag down. Oh! Oh, wow. no! Wow. Kong had it. And he air dodged. <laughs> that was. Kong actually was had insane. the kill, but because he air dodged out of the, uh, the footstool, he wasn't able to get the full height, so he just <laughs> straight up died. In fact, I think he still had his flutter jump, so he could have made it back regardless. Yeah. I thought it was over for Zach, because Zach like, fell and had like, no way to recover in time. But the footstool came to play an air dodge, it's just like, just sealed his fate. It was just it. <laughs> Good stuff to the Zach right there. Legendary stuff. <laughs> Alright, now let's see where they're going to go next for game number two. Talon was an interesting start. I rarely see Talon as a start for most sets. Since people always like usually pick PS2. I guess like one of them was like, yo, PS2? And then I was like, nah, ban that. <laughs> Let's take a look. I actually have access to those chat logs. Hey. Spill the I mean secret. for the most part that doesn't happen on mm -hmm. uh that doesn't happen on Wi-Fi because they have an automated striking system. Mm -hmm. So like you still have to go through the system, so unless they agree immediately to, to go to a specific stage. Mm, okay, so we're running it back. Sonic versus Yoshi. And they're going back to town, by the way. Yes. Not nah, town. And clearly, neither of them thought there was anything wrong with that. And that makes sense. Like, you don't want to get ripped by like, these characters. Mm. One, go! Let's so, see what like, Cog figured out between this match and the last. And let's see if he can adapt. Yeah, I mean, it, was, it was looking like uh, Cog's favor. Throughout most of the match until that, like, and that ending happened, and it was just like, whoa. Like, slowly Zach brought it back with the stray hits off the side B uh, homing attack setups that he was doing. Oh, that was really good from, uh, from Cog. He realized, he, he realized that Zach was doing some really bad homing attacks. Like, I'm just gonna give you space so that you can kind of, like, get stuck in that almost full second of landing lag after you do those. Yeah, it was like the rope to hang your stuff with right there. Like, yeah, go ahead, keep doing that. <laughs> I'm liking these egg tosses here from Cog. It's a nice way to like set up into what you're doing with Yoshi. Ooh, that could that could have been something. <laughs> okay, getting the damage is also good. That up there. Yo, nice counter <laughs> hit. <laughs> Solid oh, anti-air nice right Up airs, dude. Nice up airs from Cog. Yeah, I'm liking these. Really super careful. Yeah. You don't want, you don't want to like do something that's too nice. Then you'll be like, all right. Well, if the third one gets avoided, and then I just die for it. Ooh, no smash. Oh, oh there it God. is. There it is. Yeah, Cog barely even, like, whipping that up smash. He, he did it in the wrong direction, and then he was able to correct it like, after a second. It's good to have uh, up smashes that scoop like that. You're able to, like, kill when people, like, hit the ground, like, and they have all the lag in the world to not avoid it. Good stuff on Cog to grab a ledge and start throwing these eggs out. <laughs> Making it very tough for Zach to try to take the stock here. Ooh. What a trade. Zach has to do something to get the stock off real quick. Oh, off stage, be careful. Cog is just like, yeah, I'm not gonna let you like get away. I'm not gonna let you take a stock as easily as the last few times. I'm gonna actually get my damage in. Yeah, getting that uh, B reverse uh, neutral B right there for the quick damage. Some egg tosses. Oh, no. okay. If that down B would have been the home <laughs> attack, I would have. Uh, <laughs> genius. <laughs> it's like he read him. Oh my god. Yeah, Cog releasing shield at just the wrong moment there, too. Uh, this is good stuff right here. Oh, yeah. Nah. Oh! Nice I thought that was gonna kill. <laughs> I thought that was gonna kill. <laughs> okay. Zach has to do something here. Falling for all these tricks. Oh, the double egg lay? You're, you're dead. <laughs> you're dead. Dang. 
All the momentum is on Cog's side right now, and the stock is taken off the fresh stock. Cog with a full stock lead. He actually is evaluating his life choices on that platform. Cool. He's like, yo, know, am I doing? Am I doing good? Is this good? Yeah, he's about to like. <laughs> Exactly, was about to like say game three real quick by just staying on that platform. <laughs> oh, no jump, no jump. Okay. Uh, he's good. It's Sonic. Sonic can recover from Mad B. Yeah, that's true. Very dangerous game though when you like put yourself out there. Very, very vulnerable to get spiked. Hey, yeah. let's go. Uh, let's go, Zach, bringing it back from like, a pretty bad spot. He's still like doing it. Oops. Solid down air for the for damage. I think like a good twenty percent of your your, your stocks your percentage. I mean, Yoshi down air still puts in work. Like ever since Smash 64, I'm like, yeah, don't head by that Yoshi down air. There's one thing that's been kept the same about this character for all these years. It's like that move right there. Let it do a lot of damage. Ooh. To the point where now it killed it, I believe. <laughs> I really Questionable. Egg that was good. That was really good. You know, you did a great spin shot to get to get out there. The double egg? Oh. Yeah, no, it looked like it would have been it. Yeah, it was about to be. If you, like, moved a little bit forward to confirm that. Cog yeah. doing a good job of keeping keeping that, the distance to that mentality of, you gotta come to me, bro, I got the percentage. <laughs> I have the high ground. Yeah, and that was actually gonna take it. Yoshi. Good job, Cog. Yeah. This is hilarious. Uh, Devin asked Cog for his Twitter, and Cog replied, "Yes, I do have one." And then he never said what it was. I guess he had a, a game to play or something. Or was this before the <laughs> Cog told us what the Twitter was. <laughs> <laughs> mid stock? Okay. <laughs> no, he, he replied during mid, like the, after the first match. Uh, I. Okay. Well, there he is. Okay. <laughs> like he's, he's focused. He's got to be focused. He's playing in tournament. You can't ask him questions. Game three. <laughs> Where do you want to go? I'm guessing probably same stage. I don't know what stage of Sonic's like. But I'm assuming ones they yep, get the roll around. Typically, is a good one for him. Yeah. So that's probably going to be uh, what's his face man, Cog's man. Yeah, he put it in the, in the Twitch right there. So, Name yeah. he did great. They're going to Kalos. Ah. Uh, I didn't actually I see. see what got banned. Of course, Kalos. Big blue to, to hide the big blue. <laughs> <laughs> The blue boy in the big blue stage. <laughs> Imagine someone oh, actually that as an excuse. Oh, ooh, oh. It's changing us. Wait, yeah. I, I think I remember. I think I remember this player. Zach, was it? Like, didn't he play Sonic and Samus the last time he played here? He did, yeah. Oh, this is a Sonic and Samus player. Oh, okay. Okay. I remember. Three, I remember you, Zach. Two, one, I remember you. Go! All right, let's see if the Samus pick could actually do justice here. Yoshi is a big enough target to hit with these shots. Oh. Go straight to the platform, starts charging. I like this. Yoshi going balls deep in there just to like try to hit him, but he wanted to just take his jump so he could uh, he could hopefully kill him. But Zach is like, nah, I don't care about it. Oh, but up, he got a shield. Even a defensive. <laughs> yeah, Zach doing a good job of putting up his wall while uh, Cog's putting up his wall as well, trying to push his wall into his wall to break in. Oh. So a really important part about fighting um, about fighting projectile characters is remembering not to run too much. Uh, it's true that you might want to get to them as quickly as possible, but if you're running, you can't shield out of initial dash. So any like really good uh, projectile player will be looking specifically for that so that they can punish you for it. True. Uh, I believe running and shielding in this game is, uh, I think, a lot harder to, to do compared to the last few games. I mean, it just has like a very specific like frame lockout duration. So it's really important to be mindful of that when you're trying to approach, especially like at close range, where Ooh, a fully the parry. charged Sam shot can cause problems. Yeah, is that doing a good job uh, maintaining his wall? Cog is also doing good as well, just to try to find little gaps here and there, and not make his uh his patterns too obvious because you don't want to make it too obvious to a guy with a gun. <laughs> Yeah, uh, despite taking like 80% right at the start of the match, Cog is keeping it pretty competitive, all things considered. Yeah. Uh, one good Nair out the left side of the stage will definitely take the stock from It is almost risky from the deck. Oh, and that's gonna not kill because Yoshi's the big boy. Yeah, she's pretty obese. Oh, the downer, the missile kill. That was the good missile, too. Super missile? Okay. Super missile. Ooh. 
But down there on the whole block. He's like, no, you take 20. <laughs> that down smash really anti-aired like that? That was interesting. So I want to see Cog do more um, neutral air at the ledge, like retreating neutral air. That's almost unpunishable by those characters. And it's also like really effective at uh, at really like seeking out base get up or normal get up. Yeah, he has to be mindful of like how he's going to approach here because that be reversible option can come out and just ruin his day. And then he has to play the same game all over again. <laughs> Good to chase him when uh, Zack is vulnerable right there. Zack is doing a, a lot of those where I guess he would get hit and then start shoot, like, shooting. Like when he's off stage like that, that's like a very vulnerable spot that I hope uh, Cog would recognize. It's like Samus can't really do much after, after the animation of the shot itself. Oh, nice down and it catches the missile right there. Ooh. Okay, let's go. Sit down there well, forward. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say down there. I yeah, missed like, the downer, but I saw that sick like, forward. Most spikes to downers, man. I'm, I'm like, it's been forever since I played the game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good trade. Looks like uh, Zach's wall is being broken down thanks to that uh, forward air, that spike. Yeah, for the first time this uh, uh, this whole match, uh, Cog finally has something resembling a lead. I think he's got to do some damage first to really make it worth something, but he could take this if he's uh, if he's really careful about it. Ooh, that shot actually hit. Ooh, interesting. Oh, watch these missiles. Yeah. Good, good on Cog to jump in at that right time right there just to avoid all Samus' uh, zoning tools. Yeah, random burst option, dash attack. The stock right there, even game. Oh, I thought that was it. Oh, quick damage coming in from Zach. Three nice uh, three pieces right there. Take it back to 50 for him. The egg lay to more damage. Ooh. Oh, nice ducks under the, the quick shot right there. He's barely like going over his head, too. Yeah, that was so bad. Oh, <laughs> with the grab. Oh, the grab. The range. The range he has. Cog 100% not backing down like at any point. You can't show a character like Samus Mercy because if you do, you, you give Samus a chance to build like this wall right here. Like, it, it could spell game over for you. It's very frustrating to break. Yeah, Cog doing actually a great job. Like he's just looking at uh, what Zach's doing and he's waiting to see when Zach's gonna kind of make a mistake and when he can just kind of jump in and take him out. But hey, Zach's like not giving him that. Uh, he's that not giving him what he wants. A shield poke down there. Oh, right there. That's right. Oh my! That's what I mentioned, That's what I mentioned before. The so, mad deep. The charge shots off stage. Lee Sam is super vulnerable to get hit like that. And the set goes to Cog. Good stuff to Cog. Wow. <laughs> I wasn't expecting uh, the forward to, the, to come in from deep right there, but Cog uh, pulled it off. That's pretty good. Forward gang. Alright, so what do we have up next? Uh, humorously enough, uh, our first open match is Cog vs. Jopon. Mm. Uh, let's see if I can get something else in here. Because, uh, yeah, Fly vs. Mag, I asked them they didn't want to really play on stream, so we're going to be not doing that one. It's true. Can't really blame them. You know, and some people, it wasn't Lia, uh, Mag said he didn't want to. Which is like, yeah, I can I can respect that, but if you make it to the next round, you're totally playing on stream, so that'll be yeah. a little bit. Yeah, looks like we're gonna have WebJP versus 